the Supernova channel. How's everybody doing out there? Okay, we're in Carmen, Mexico, on the beach, facing north, directly north. Cranking the music up some today, and let's get this show going. What you're going to see is here, the sun rises about a little before 7, or now 8 because of the time change. And you can see clearly there's all kinds of light sources up in those bright skies. But then we're going to go to, this is just some of the stuff. I took a lot of the pictures they took out out of here, and then I got the live clip time-lapsed at the end but you're going to see this moon come straight out of the north going south it's got a black ring around it you're going to see um, all kinds of stellar cores i think lighting up in the north when that moon comes up and then there's a huge sunburst uh you can see it's really like a planet and you're going to see shadows from the north at like eight o'clock at night when the sun's going down just keep watching and enjoy the music. Let's get this show on the road. It's not normal, people. Now, I've seen northern sunrises in Canada, Alaska, which make more sense, but not from Mexico. What's up? And I'm wondering if there's just stellar cores happening and never a straight answer. I don't know what to do with it. Anybody see that uh, MMB, TV3? Spaceship he showed yesterday. I think it was uh, Saturday. Awesome. Awesome capture. I see stuff like that all the time, but people don't believe me because they're so offended I'm using filters. But this has no filters on it, but keep watching. Right? see it right there clear as day some types of light sources uh i'm gonna call them stellar cores but you see the shadow now the middle lights up with like a sun flare like a like a sun simulator flare you know it lights up and goes up and down well that happens right here but i think it's actually a planet back there that is reflecting the stellar cores you know the sun's going down southwest or whatever and then this moon black ring moon object comes in and lights up possibly a moon simulator sun simulator now remember that's the moon that's supposed to be the moon but it's coming directly out of the north and i'm going to show you on a live clip but um maestro continue got some popeyes chicken out there for me people i want a piece popeyes
lots of people waking up out there that are not awake. And those that have been awake for a long time, fell back asleep, welcome to the Awakening Group. The Awoken, I think, they saw. I don't know if I'm an Awoken. I'm totally awake. <laughs> I'm not a walking Awoken. <laughs> Anyways, okay, here we go. I found the live clip. Took me about 45 minutes of recording this. And uh, you're going to see some weird stuff going on in the north. This is approximately... Uh, sun just went down south or southwest or wherever it went to. The sun that came up in the north went somewhere, right? So, and here comes that moon on the right. See that little dot right there on the right? It's going to grow. So here we go. So I have a uh, special message from our sponsoring headquarters, Embassy of God. Uh, has a message for his disciples out there, those who serve Christ Jesus, those who know him. So be prepared. It's going to be an intense message for you people. Open up your ears, wake up, open up your eyes. Look at that whole system right there in the north. Oh, just watch it. Pictures speak louder than words, right? I ain't no scientist. Before Jesus went to the cross, he said these words to his disciples. I will not speak with you much longer, for the prince of this world is coming and he has no hold on me. But the world must learn that I love the Father and that I do exactly what the Father has commanded me. And he knew what was coming and said, I am sending you out as sheep amongst wolves. Therefore, be as shrewd as snakes and harmless as doves. And he told them not to be afraid. Do not be afraid of him who can kill the body, he said. But rather fear him who can destroy both body and soul in hell. that he knows what is coming, that he knows what is coming, that he knows the days that are ahead of you. And he is raising up martyrs again, many who will go out and who will shed their blood as he shed his blood. But he said to comfort them with these words. Tell them. I know what is coming. Do not be afraid. Do not be afraid. The prince of this world is rising again. And he is rising with all the fury that is in him. And he is out to destroy everything that I have created, both the land and the sea. And the universe and the people. And he is coming with all the fury of hell for destruction. For he comes to kill, to steal, and to destroy. But tell my disciples not to be afraid. For before he does it, I know what is coming. And I am sending them out like sheep amongst wolves. And the power that is in them is greater than the power that is in him. And as they go out fearless, they will overcome him. In this world they will have tribulation, but they are not to be afraid. For I have overcome the world. And through them, 
I will continue to overcome the world. And I will do it one by one, person by person, soul by soul. I will overcome all of his schemes and all of his plans. For the prince of this world is coming, but he has nothing in me. He has nothing in me. sign of destruction, blood, into a sign of victory, blood! And the blood of the martyrs! I see the blood of the martyrs! Word of their testimony. And the world will see that I have loved my father. 
and the world will see that they have loved me. Loving not their lives unto death. The world will see.